Nickel is a naturally occurring element and millions of tons of it are mined each year across the globe. Pure nickel is a hard silvery white metal used to make stainless steel and other metal alloys. The Agency for Toxic Substances and Disease Registry reports that these alloys are used to make coins, jewelry, and other items. Nickel can also be combined with other elements to form nickel compounds. Nickel compounds are used for nickel plating, to color ceramics, to make some batteries, and as catalysts. According to the National Institute for Occupational Safety and Health, workers may be harmed from exposure to nickel with the level of exposure depending upon the dose, duration, and work being done. Some examples of worker NIOSH lists that are potentially at risk include refinery workers and nickel processing plants, jewelry and pawn shop workers who come in contact with nickel coins or jewelry, factory workers and plants where nickel alloys are used, and workers who come in contact with tools and other nickel releasing surfaces. Anyone can be exposed by breathing dust containing it, through skin contact, or by consuming food or water that contains nickel. A common health effect of nickel exposure is an allergic reaction and approximately 10 to 20 percent of the population is sensitive to nickel according to the Agency for Toxic Substances and Disease Registry. The most common reaction is a skin rash at the site of contact, but the skin rash may also occur at a site away from the site of contact. Less frequently, some people who are sensitive to nickel have asthma attacks following exposure. The agency also shares the fact that workers in nickel refineries or nickel processing plants have experienced chronic bronchitis and reduced lung function by breathing elevated levels of it. Workers who have drank water containing high amounts of nickel have experienced stomach aches and suffered adverse effects to their blood and kidneys. Cancers of the lung and nasal sinus have resulted when workers breathe dust containing high levels of nickel compounds while working in nickel refineries or nickel processing plants. The Department of Health and Human Services has determined that nickel metal may reasonably be anticipated to be a carcinogen and that nickel compounds are known human carcinogens. The International Agency for Research on Cancer has determined that some nickel compounds are carcinogenic to humans and that metallic nickel may possibly be carcinogenic to humans. The Environmental Protection Agency has determined that nickel refinery dust and nickel subsulfide are human carcinogens. These are just a few things to know about nickel and potential exposure risks. To learn more about this or other industrial hygiene, air quality, environmental health, or safety issues, please visit the website shown on the screen. IAQ-TV, the place to be.